All right, man, topic for the day. I think this is a really good one. Um, and I need people to chime in on this one. Do you think DNA tests should be mandatory for women and men when giving birth? No child support involved, no government involved. But, you know, now if you do it, usually you got to come with some. That's why people don't do it is because, you know, if it's yours, there's a possibility she can go ahead and put you on child support. Well, let's say other child support. Should people just know or yeah. have a DNA test? I feel like they should. If you are not married, I feel like it should be mandatory. If you are not married? Yeah, if you girlfriend, boyfriend, even if you're still engaged, I feel like it should be mandatory. Because these days, the world is getting wilder and wilder. Even if you, you can't are blame married. anybody for being like, man, you know. Because, you know, you got to wait for the baby to grow into his features before I can take it to my mom and be like, is this wow, mine? Wow, that's too long. See, let's do, let's do a blessing. Let's do a little swab right now, you know, while she's still under anesthesia, so she can't argue. Just make sure it is mine. Because, I mean, it's going to, you know, all jokes aside, it's going to hurt in the long run. What if that is not your child? I mean, would you rather find out now or later? Now. Let's, let's I mean, do you feel now. like uh, women who do that, do you, think they should, do you feel like they should be charged? Criminal, criminally. And so, if you were sucking, you were sent. You were sent. You were sucker. That's just it. <laughs> I don't even know. Like, it depends on what she's trying to do. Now, she's trying to take you to court and trying to. You know, I mean, take I you know. Court. I know men that have paid child support for kids that women know or not. Not there. That they just civil. That's straight civil, right? So no there. criminal. Can't be criminal. I man. feel like maybe certain rules should be applied, and after certain. This happens after certain that happens. She should probably give a little time. Why? Yeah, you know I'm saying why not criminal? I mean, because bro. if this man gives his money, if yeah. money was already given, I feel like if the process is already under the way, or if some payments have been made already, and then later they find out, it like, could be fraud. It just that depends. should exactly is what they should be charged for. What? She knew that baby. That baby knows. But that's why that, that baby ain't got no bell pepper nose. She knew that baby. <laughs> She that's why having the DNA test should be mandatory, I feel like, if you're not married. What if the baby there ain't in Well, then here you are. I don't know. What, what kind of nose is that? You know that baby ain't got no belt for nose. <laughs> you know, I have no idea why that's it with me, so. You know that baby ain't got no belt. I hate this baby. <laughs> like, man, look. That baby for don't me, look like me. Look, man, for me, I've seen it, man. Oh. Like, people don't understand, like, anytime there's a system, there's always a person trying to find a loophole. Sure. Where there's a loophole, somebody is getting <laughs> done over, man. Which is why I'm saying civil, because it, you, you don't have to prove it should as be, much. It should be criminal. Let me tell you why it should be criminal. Because if I don't pay child support, I have to go to jail. That's true. That's, that's true. I have to go to jail. Man, take her to court. If that's, if that's not your baby daddy, if that's, if you not the baby daddy, and you been paying child support, and she know that that's not your baby, she should have to face some time. She should have to fall <coughs> on some repercussions. That's Something. True. I'm sorry, that's how I feel. All right, if, don't shoot the messenger. Don't spin the block on the messenger. I'm just nah. It is a sensitive subject. I halfway, I'm halfway with you. There are always different circumstances. <laughs> but civil is easier to prove. Excuse me, civil, it's easier to get a favorable verdict civilly, in civil cases, excuse me, in civil cases as opposed to criminal. Because you got to prove malicious intent, which some do give it off, so it'll make it evil. We just had a case where their attitude kind of was detrimental to their case. It just depends on the situation, but it's always easier to do civil. That's how they got OJ on a civil case. I said I got like OJ, but OJ should have never went back to that room. Like, how you go get locked up for stealing your own stuff? No, no, no. I'm talking. I'm talking about with uh, when he killed the when he killed the wife, or allegedly killed the wife. I mean, I know he got. I mean, for the, I mean, let's okay for the wife thing. That was just really like his son did it. Yeah, I think it was son. I think it was his son did it. His son did it. I think it was sure. Bruce Jenner. Yeah, he had to just Dan oh. Deardorff. One of them did it. Somebody did it. Somebody Simpson did it, man. Man. But you're right. I think I agree that it should be a blood test. I mean, I thought they had to have a blood. No, it was, it was a blood test to get married. Is what they did from the '70s back, right? 
They had to have a blood test to get married. I, for whatever reason, mm. I had yeah, to look it up. Because, because of incest, they didn't want people getting married that was probably related to each other. <laughs> Most likely. Way to go, um, Florida. Yeah, don't do that. <laughs> um, all right, man. Um, the morning roll up, 88.7 FM, Power 214. Before we get up out of here, we got some questions. We're going to put you in the hot seat. It's all time. Right. It's time. It's that time. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. In this game we play, it's called Would You Rather. Mm-hmm. All right, here we go. <laughs> She's already done. This is where this relationship goes. Would you be married and broke, divorced, lonely, and paid, or C, a sugar baby slash sugar mama? I'll hit him with the... Lonely and paid. Lonely and paid. Because I've been sick for eight years. I kind of know what that feels like. Oh, my God. You know what I mean? So I kind of get the feeling of, because being lonely is hard. It really is. You know what I mean? Yeah. All I'm lacking right now is a little bit of money, but I feel like if the money was there, I'd be all right. You'd be all right. You go shopping. Be single is cool. I go travel around the world. Why would I be a sugar baby? Yeah. Why wouldn't I be a sugar baby? It's just not, I just, it's just not my thing. Dignity. It's not for me. Have you Dignity. tried it? Not that I'm asking to. I really, I really, I did try. I don't judge you. Anybody who does it, do your thing, get it how you live. But I tried it, and I could have got myself in trouble. So I, <laughs> I went on this website that this girl told me about why I did it. Mm. The guy, I met up with the guy, and I was like, okay, I can do this. And I told him I broke. I said, I ain't never done this before. <laughs> 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 and, and thank God he was nice and just took me home. Oh wow! You know, some real ish. You could have been some I goons. I could have got kidnapped. I could have got all kinds of stuff you can think of as a young woman in LA with a, a old man with hell money. You know, a lot of crazy stuff could have happened. But the Lord was with me. I did could have been like Jamie Foxx for myself. No, that's <laughs> for myself. For oh, yourself, okay. That's what's up. All right, interesting. All right, um, would you rather have your friend, or would you rather have a friend that's broke every time y'all go out, a friend that loves trauma, loves to fight, or a friend with money but throws it in your face? (laughs) (laughs) Would you rather? I mean, uh, I, I choose the broke friend. The broke friend? I think I choose the broke friend. Why? Because if the 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 friend is throwing money, it, you know, all the riches in my face, that means I'm the broke friend. You know, so I mean, you may not be the broke friend. You just may not have as much money as that they have. People like that, it's just, I'm not, it's not going to work out. They can ruin everybody's life. I mean, like, so, like, for I don't example. I don't you pay for everything. For, yeah, it? but for example, like, y'all go out to the club, you can buy your own drink. But, right. that, you know, you may not feel like buying the section, but they going to buy the section. But remind you that they bought the But section. remind you that you, you drinking out of my bottle. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, that's corny. I don't want it. Yeah, there you go. I don't. So you rather, so you rather have a broke friend have a good time? Yeah, because if money. I keep a broke friend around, that means it's a real friend. So and maybe I can help that friend. friend. What? You're going to tell me. Hey, 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 to be around me broke, it has to be somebody I really like. consider a, a true friend to be like, you can bring your broke ass. This <laughs> <laughs> cool, this cool, like that. Every time. At I least you didn't it. pick the drama one. Yeah. I, no, I hate drama. Sometimes you gotta have people who love to fight in your corner, though. That was me. Till I got old. <laughs> I like to be cute in, in my own little situation, get lit with my people. I don't want no hate nap. You know, well, yeah, I don't those want nobody people. hating and nobody H-A-N. Trying, or trying to look for something to talk about when it comes to putting other people in a bad light. Like, girl, look what she got on. It's Are those white shoes? Oh yeah, I love those type of friends. Yeah, yes. yeah. I, I don't that. like that. I feel that. 
All right, last one we got, man. Last one. I think this is a good one. It's gonna tell me about yourself. Oh God. Would you rather date a felon <laughs> that has a charge? A convicted felon that has a charge, assault and battery, statutory rape, okay. or manslaughter. Lord, and why? Let's say it one more time. You have to date a felon. Okay. With one of these charges. Okay. Assault and battery, <laughs> statutory rape, and manslaughter. I mean, assault. Damn. You went to assault? Because <laughs> no, there's different assault and batteries. But then because I've dated two, I have dated. <laughs> you see how she went straight to the assault one? Oh Didn't even blink. I have dated two guys that have done the first and the last one. Mm. So that's my just kind of. Well, you know, with, with statutory rape sometimes is maybe like a... Maybe like you was 18, she was 16, they found out you shouldn't have either been dating way, somebody. Either way, you can't get nowhere with that type of charge. Yeah, nah, that ain't... I mean, either one of those is like, offender. yeah, you know, you, you have accidental manslaughter and mm. stuff. Yeah, you do. And assault and battery, the pits. It has could, have a, been could have been defending himself. Yeah, exactly. Just got a little so, carried away. Yeah, so I... So you dated one A and Z, huh, basically? I, I, <laughs> I did an ANC. Okay, I had an ANC in my life. And she was just, then, she quickly, well, I mean, define assault. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Define assault. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Well, then, you know, when you hear assault and battery, you think somebody whooping, you know, domestic yeah, violence. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wait, but, but how many years in between we started dating and the assault charge? Yeah. You know, you were trying to find reasons. Up, I did grow up in the hood, like Amarillo, Texas. Is Nothing but those kind of. That's. Amarillo? Yeah. That's not food. Not where the hell I grew up at. She said, hey. When you think about it, you can think of all the things you can think, but I've lived in Amarillo for 10 years and I've seen a lot of things, heard a lot of things, been through a lot of things. That's West Texas. And I know it, it goes down. It was, a, it was a hot mess. So, yeah, that's why I said I've, I've been with. That's how and I know there's different kinds of assault. Okay. Different kinds of cattle rustlers. But I, I she had to get a fact check on that. Yeah, <laughs> had to get a fact check. But that was just that was just hilarious because you like all of a sudden shrunk in like, well, uh, yeah. yeah, well, you got perfect. Hit me one. <laughs> <laughs> the skin didn't break. It was just a bruise. It wasn't really an assault. I just called him over. Woo! I mean, hey, like, ground. You know, stand your ground. Yeah, you got to stand your ground, right? That's what it is. That's Don't what tell it is. nobody. I ain't saying nothing else. Man, I definitely <laughs> appreciate you coming through, man. Chief Fontaine, definitely appreciate you coming through. Tell people where they can follow you, find you, listen to your music, all that good stuff. Everything is Chief Fontaine, C-H-I-I-F-O-N-T-A-I-N-E. That's on Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, all of the platforms. So, it's really big, easy. Man. If you know how to spell, you'll find Mm. Alrighty, man. I definitely appreciate you coming through, locking in with us, man. The early morning roll up. Me and my brother Shampoo locked in. Power 214, 88.7, the Blaze FM. Bang. <laughs> Dog life, baby!